What's up, babes? This is Chris Victoria back with another video. If you guys are new here, hi, welcome to my channel. If you've already been subscribed, thanks for coming back. So look, babes, your girl face look a little, it looked like it's been going through it, okay? So let me tell you what's up. I went outside, did some clash, uh, some clash, some trash picking up, and um, kind of got some heat pumps in my face. Looks a little, uh, and then also I am dyeing my hair right now, so I'm just looking real like everything is, literally showing up because one my hair is being dyed jet black like i'm freshening up by jet black two i was outside like i said hot with heat bumps so black just draws everything out it's like so classy so pretty but it definitely shows the imperfections so my face is a little broken out still got the scar from y'all's little internet niece miss brooks my dog it hasn't gone away. I need to start working at like actually trying to get that to be removed. But right now I'm just sitting in a few trash bags with my hair covered in the hair dye. I am washing my hair today. I'm going to style my hair today. I don't think I'm doing a standard retwist because I don't know what time it is right now. But I think it's almost like 3 o'clock. And because of that, that means that I need to go ahead, wash my hair and actually do something to it. So I'm not sure if I'm going to wash it. And then let it air dry and then put edge control on it tonight and then wash it again tomorrow and actually style it. I haven't decided yet what I'm doing. I just knew I, I needed to do stages of freshening up my dye. So yesterday was basically me washing it and having my hair clean. Today was about me applying the dark and lovely hair dye to my hair. And then today is really about washing it, getting it out. Now, normally I like to wash my hair at least twice before I style it to make sure like two different days, two or three different days to ensure that my hands are already like messed up from the dye. But I like to do that to ensure that the residue of the dye is completely gone from my hair. So that's why I stay in my hair dye for quite some time. And then I um, wash it out as well as I can. So like I told you guys the other day, I was about to do a retwist or some type of video I didn't. I did a hair lock talk video these last few days, but I did not style it. And today, like I said, I don't I don't think I'm going to style it today. I think I might end up just washing it, adding some edge control, and then come tomorrow or in a few days, I'll style it. Just because I'm a little pressed for time right now, um, fresh hair dye, wet hair, all that is going to have to take into account for air drying time, stuff like that. So I guess... Once I take a shower, I'll know exactly what I'm doing once I get out. But regardless, I'm going to have to air dry. My hair's going to have to air dry just a little bit. So that's that. So I'm going to focus on striving to get that together, get my skin back. I'm drinking a lot of Coca-Cola. Um, I did drink a water and a half, water bottle and a half. I need to keep drinking my fluids, though, but I, I your girl... Your girl is still drinking her Coca-Cola and it's showing up on her face. Now, I did go get my eyebrows like shaped up the other day and she didn't do too good. So, it doesn't look like anything really happened. My eyebrows are just thick. I need to start doing my own eyebrows so I can control the way that they look. Because lately, the girl who's did my lashes, who's done my eyebrows, she's not doing too well. And I'm not, too, and I'm not talking about sick. I'm just talking about performance. I think she might be taking on too much volume. Um... And she's not perfecting my brows and my lashes like she once was. Because there's too many people stacked. So you're rushing, essentially. And I'm not liking that. Now, maybe other people are satisfied. But I'm not other people I know. I haven't been satisfied. So when she seen me recently, she asked me if I was doing my lashes. I was like, no, I'm just going to do my brows. Nothing against her. It's just not working for me. So brows and lashes were done. So that's it. But like I said, I'm going to jump in the shower in a second and wash this on my hair. I'm just striving to get situated. Um, but yeah, so I don't know if I'm going to come back on the video or if I'm only going to... I might come back after the wash so I can tell you guys exactly what I'm planning to do to style my hair for the day. And I guess we can go from there. So make sure y'all stay tuned. Like, comment, share, subscribe at some point in the video. I will be back with an update. So stay tuned. All right, babe. So out of the shower... I already told y'all my face look a little broken out, heat bump scars, a whole bunch of things. 
I'm drinking some water now, but tonight, being that my hair is freshly dyed, I, and I do have a pool tournament, I am going to do my makeup tonight, just, you know, so I can look put together. Now, my face in, in this video is going to start to look a little ashy because I did not put, I washed my face with my aloe, but I have not put my serum on my face yet. So, it typically tends to give me a washed out look um, after using it. But the face wash is so good. It is so gentle, but I'm going to likely put um, a primer on as well. So... This is what your girl is looking like. Like I said, it really was about the hair dye. I'm sitting in a towel right now, just letting my hair drip onto the towel, the excess water, because you guys know I don't like to towel dry and I don't like to blow dry thy hair. But if you look, I don't know if you guys can tell, I'm gonna try to brighten up the lights. I don't know if that's helping, but if you were looking earlier, I'm not sure too sure if it looks darker to you or the camera's not just given enough for you guys to be able to tell or can you tell that my hair has gotten darker i use dark and lovely jet black hair dye you guys know i use that to freshen up my hair is getting longer so that means that i'm going to need to use probably like three boxes i do need to stay away from the dye for a little while i might wait uh to dye my hair again when my birthday comes, which you guys know, I'm February 17th is your girl's birthday. So I might wait until my birthday come to freshen it up around my birthday um, and just give it a rest on freshening it up going forward. Uh, but I wanted to get it back fresh black, looking good, feeling good type, but you know, you know how it is, girls who love jet black hair. You know how it is. You want that hair to remain jet. Like if you're born with naturally jet black hair, shout out to you. Cause baby, it's it's definitely a color to have. And you guys know black is my favorite color. So we, we're gonna be jet black regardless. So like I said, I did my hair. I don't know exactly how I'm gonna style it because it's too late in the afternoon for me to do um, like uh, individual like flat twists or individual retwist like it's it's too late in the day before i have to go and i don't want to put clips in my hair and then turn around and i can't keep the clips in my hair because i gotta go so what i'm gonna end up doing is probably doing like a braid out but i might do bigger braids so i might twist at my roots and braid like six together and do like bigger braids that way my roots are intact but i don't have to um wait around all night trying to braid my hair. Either I'm gonna do that, or I'm gonna wear my hair half up, half down, um, once it air dries, and put some edge control on it, and then come tomorrow, then I can style it or do something. But I think if I could do like six to 10 big fat braids, that'll do the job too, because it'll allow my roots to be twisted, you know, and then I could take that out and I could wear it, um, curly on other days so i'm not exactly sure what i'm gonna do right now i got a lot of hair but because it is new growth and i've been told that my new growth is through the roof it is um but because i have a lot of new growth i think what i'm gonna do is tackle this even if it's bigger braids just to have it tackled and if i gotta wear a hat or um like a bucket hat or something then I will do that. But if it looks fine afterwards, then I might just keep it as is. Like I said, I do have a tournament to go to. So I can't just be lollygagging and sitting around. Y'all know I'm okay with my new growth, like ruling my hair. I don't have to retwist my hair every so often. But every so often I need to because my roots are getting thicker and I am getting extensive new growth and I need to separate my locks and stuff like that. So Every now and again, I am going to do that, but I'm like not pressed to do it, but I do it, if that makes any sense. So that's what I'm going to do. Get that tackled. Yeah, I think if I can get about, I don't care about six to ten big dookie braids, but, or, but my roots are retwisted, then I think we can have somewhere to go on that because... 
right now, your girl is new growth is new growth. Okay, we're just gonna say it like that. New growth is new growth. So I hope you all enjoy this video. I will be back. I know I keep making different segments of the video. I don't want to sit down and start doing my hair and then have you guys watching me because I need to focus in the mirror. Even though I can do my hair without the mirror, I need to look in the mirror to make sure that we are getting this excess hair because I have hair growing outside of my locks. At this point, we need to make sure that we're doing our best to combine as much hair as we can into the locks. And then, like I said, I'm going to do some braids real quick. I don't have time to do two strand twists and I don't have time to do very small braids, but I think a few of them will get the job done. A few of them will get the job done. So I'll see you beautiful babies in the next video. Make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. I'll see y'all later. And hopefully something will be done to my hair. Even if I don't do it, edge control is going to have to be applied. Something very much so. Something is going to have to be applied. Because I'm not putting makeup on right now. I'm going to go ahead and go put my serum on my face. Throw on an oversized t-shirt. Um, and then maybe take the next hour, hour and a half to really try to do something with this hair. I'll see you beautiful babies in the next video. Later.